Welcome to the Law Reporters, and today we bring you the top 5 latest updates. The US government filed a lawsuit against eBay, alleging that the online platform had breached environmental laws, including the Clean Air Act, by permitting the sale of various harmful products. eBay may be subject to substantial penalties, with the potential for fines as much as $5,580 per violation of the Clean Air Act as outlined in the government's complaint lodged in the federal court located in Brooklyn, New York. In another update today, Dubai plans to develop a wide range of transformational projects spanning critical sectors like transportation, aviation, urban planning, and healthcare. The approval for these visionary projects has been granted by His Highness Sheikh Hamdan as part of the Dubai 10X initiative. These initiatives form a crucial component of the third phase of the Dubai 10X program, driven by the Dubai Future Foundation. The primary objective is to establish Dubai as a global frontrunner in future preparedness. In further updates, S&P analysts predict that the UAE's economy will experience a 3% growth in 2023, followed by a 4% growth in 2024. This growth is primarily attributed to the non-oil sector, which is anticipated to thrive due to the robust tourism, government-driven programs, and technological advancements. These strategic initiatives have been carefully designed to lay the foundation for enduring, extending economic growth. Additionally, the Speaker of Bahrain's House of Representatives has proposed the questioning of two ministers by members of parliament concerning allegations and frequent terminations and layoffs of Bahraini employees at Gulf Air. The Speaker has recommended that the Transportation and Telecommunications Minister, who oversees Bahrain Muntalakar Holding Company, be subject to questioning. Additionally, the Speaker has called for an inquiry into the actions of the Kingdom's Labour Minister. And in today's final news update, the Abu Dhabi Investment Authority is reportedly considering a $600 million investment in Mukesh Ambani's Reliance Retail Ventures Limited. As per sources, this investment is poised to be at valuations nearly 60% higher than those observed in the previous funding round three years ago. These have been your top 5 news updates. Stay tuned tomorrow for more.